So Jasmine, some of course might find it too intrusive, but the students we talk to say they don't have a problem with the random testing. I think that's fine because I feel like I would want to know how many people are, are getting it so I can know how um, cautious I need to be. UCF officials say they will start the random COVID-19 testing with a random sample of about 100 students from various sororities and fraternities. The reason across the country, students who belong to Greek organizations have been at higher risk, and UCF says they've already had to quarantine residents of three Greek houses on campus because of coronavirus outbreaks. According to UCF's dashboard, among students and staff who tested positive on campus when moving into dorms or self-reported, there have been more than 900 cases of COVID-19. COVID-19 since March. The random testing will eventually move to other groups identified as high risk, go through the semester, and will include faculty and staff also randomly selected. UCF says the random testing is aimed at determining how prevalent the virus is on campus so the university can strengthen efforts to slow the spread and protect students' health. Now, those students selected for testing will be notified by email and told where to go and when. Jasmine, Adrian, back to you. Thanks, Alex. The